So we hear the all winner press conference here in Shenzhen. And who are you? This is Gong from the business department of Market Center in Ho from All Winner headquarters. What I'm holding is the A63 built in tablets products. This is a, a 64, 64 bit uh, uh, chipset. Yes. Uh, so this is the newest generation. You have three new chipset for the tablet market, right? Uh, yes. All Winner All Winner is a leader in the Android tablet SOC in the world. Yes. Uh, today we are joined by so many independent de design houses and our customers. They are asking for higher CPU performance and higher GPU and low cost, cost efficient products. And now we are launching free chips today. Uh, let's let's just me. quickly, uh, just go quickly in here. Just gonna quickly go. Uh, this is the middle of the press conference right now. Yes. Launching the A63. And um, the A63 is a powerful new 64-bit uh, quad-core A53. Yes, indeed. It also has uh, AI. Yeah, we already started implementing our uh, this fake face recognition and following by the voice recognition AI into the chip. So yeah. like there, for example, this is the Owner Canteen, I think, right, in, in Zuhai. Yes. And uh, you can recognize the face. It's all running on the GPU? Yes, it's already running on the SOC and GPU. All right. Yeah, I mean, algorithm. And let's check over here. You have uh, some information about it. Um, so, so what's uh, special about it? Uh, it has uh, so 4K all, video support. The 60-bit yeah. GPU is running in 1.8 gigahertz. And with the AI, it says the uh, artificial intelligence support. Yes, it recognizes pictures and, and the face recognition. And it's also capable of decoding the 4K radio and output in 2Ks. Maybe this is, two, it could be a 2K display potentially, or a bigger, bigger tablet could have a 2K display. Yes. Uh, this is the new GPU. Before it was uh, a lower spec GPU, now it's a. Uh, yeah, now it's, it's running in Mali T760 MP2 GPU, which is quite powerful for yeah. running and support this uh, large scale 3D games nowadays, is, which is popular on phone and the tablets. Nice. And uh, maybe it also has uh, uh, more specs in the different places here. It can do. Uh, it can do display port and, and output. Uh, it can do, uh, maybe it has a faster RAM support. Uh, it can, oh, this one got DDR3, right? But yeah, DDR3 and LPDDR3. LPDDR3. Uh, this is available, it's going to be for uh, affordable tablets, right? Yes. On 64 bit. But this is still your high end. Yes, it's targeting for the high end uh, tablets product. And here at the show, you are also launching another chipset. Uh, it's called the A50, All Winner A50. And this is a 32 bit. Yeah, 32 bit processor, which is targeting at the mid end tablet devices. Because in the tablet market, still uh, maybe a 32 bit is slightly more popular. Like the A33 is your biggest seller, right? Or the A64, like of the previous generation. For Yes, kind of. We have a uh, 33 uh, previously, a couple of years ago, from 2014 to now, our A33s already have a quite amount of sales number. It reached 60 million. More than 60 million? More than 60 million sales globally. 60 million tablets were shipped on the 32 bit platform. So this is the latest uh, quad core E7, uh, and it's running on this one right here. It's very light. Uh, very maybe very it's affordable. for Nextbook uh, with a partner Nextbook right here, and so this is going to be able to. Um, now it's playing the, the 4K radio. So this one can have a, a also a slightly higher resolution display, right? 1080p display. Yeah, it's supporting. This camera is supporting uh, 30 million p, and also we have the high performance radio decoding capability. Maybe you have some specs right here. We can check. Uh, this is the block diagram. So it's a Mali 400 MP2. Uh, it has it supports lots of low stuff. Power, low power DDR4 and the DDR4 as well. So this is a low power DDR4, so it has a newer spec for the, the RAM. 
Uh, it has trust zone to, to support military two bit, data. and it can do uh, even some some display out over there, but no no display port. There's some other some other things, and this is now on 28 nanometers, right? Um, before the A33 was on 40. Yeah, it's a 40 nanometer. This is a huge upgrade. We are moving it from 40 nanometer, 40 nanometer to 28 nanometer with lower uh, heat. Yeah, so lower power consumption. Yeah, lower power consumption and uh, smaller chipset small, size. Yes, yeah, yeah, small. Yeah, this chipset size with 28 nanometer, you can make the PC people more compact to fit in more small models for these differentiated yeah. products. And also, we are one of the key features. We supporting the free. 3D TCL NAND flash. So the, this uh, TLC NAND flash uh, is a better flash, is better storage, now a faster memory. Yes, Not only faster. in the RAM, but also in the storage. Yes. For nowadays, I think there's a great uh, expense increase on these storage devices, including the... Can we, can we cut that no problem. It's just, it's just uh, so, so basically, basically you're improving the RAM, and you're including the, the flash, and uh, including lots of stuff, and it, maybe it's a smaller chipset, so maybe it could be even more affordable. But even though the A33 is very affordable already, but if people want even more affordable, you have an even lower spec 32-bit you're also launching today, right? Yes. And that's... Um, it's a 3 g today. A, uh, we don't have the extra port. So A thirty three G is that's that's the most entry level. Yes, the entry level for tablet products. For A three three G, there's an upgrade version of the previous, the most popular yeah. one, the A three three. And today, the most the key selling point of A three three G we have is we will bundle it with our power management unit, which can manipulate this voltage and uh, the process power based on different threads you are running or different workload you are trying to occupy, try, trying to operating. Yeah. And we also we will work with our XR829, the Wi-Fi and BT 4.1 model. Oh, that's also from All Winner. Yes, it's also from All Winner. It's one of the wireless products from All Winner. This will the, be launched the new, today. The new yeah. also. Yeah, the new. So you, you, do, you do Bluetooth part, you do Wi-Fi part. Yes. And I heard before that you're even doing memory. But that's yes, not yet, memory right? is still under memory. development. Yeah, still under development. Not yes. yet. Yeah, not yet. So uh, maybe that's that's probably something. Maybe they're talking. Let's let's just jump in here quickly again, because it's very interesting to see. So I may have heard they're just introducing the XR829. That's that's uh what is that? That's that the... that's a Wi-Fi plus boot Bluetooth 4.1 model, the single chips which will be uh, working together with our SOC products. Also for the A63? Not and only the for the A63, but they... All of them. In, in the future, they will no, no longer work with our A-series chipset, but also the H-series and also the R-series chipset from all winner. So um, that means you will have a whole package solution, everything nearly, just uh, still yes. need the, the, the modem? Yeah, and I still need the, the, the flash, the RAM, yes. right? Our, our ultra target is to prepare our customer a total turnkey solution. Then don't, they, they don't have the integrated this memory or the Wi-Fi model they sell. We have a total software packages which they can make it turnkey, which, which may can shorten their development period, which may, uh, eventually they can make the product launch to the market quite soon. It's and also uh, now a, a big new challenge, and it's also very interesting. How are you supporting your customers to make a GMS uh, uh, and constantly update the software? Right? Is there something happening with this? Yes, we already have the oh, wow. A50 tablets already running at Android. Good. 
Yeah. Do yeah. Again? yeah. No, no, no. So, so you said you're already running Android 7 or 8, yeah. Android 8, right? Yes. We are already running the Android uh, 8.1 system yeah. on the A50 tablets. So already the latest Android is supported, but uh, now this this thing that I understand is happening with the Android 8.1 is that uh, Google is doing a Project Treble, right? Where they help, they hopefully they you work with them to help your customer keep updated and keep yes. the security patch and keep also the software updated, right? Yes, we keep our customer to pass the GMS certifications with our chipset. So th that's very important now because they yes. have new requirements, right? Uh, Google is doing some new GMS kind of things on their... Uh, so, so now you will have latest software. Yes. When, uh, I think when Google, when they launch their new systems, they have to uh, have a deadline for their customer to upgrade the system up to date in three months. All so. Right. Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> still here. Sorry, we'll stand out here because it's a beautiful area right here. Okay. Shenzhen is, uh, is is moving very very fast, right? Uh, uh, the tablet market exploded so quickly, but now it's a very big challenge for for uh, all winner to find new markets too. Yes, all winner is try to help our customer to deep to go deeper in this differentiated products. Pro for instance, we use the tablets to get into the education market, but also the gaming tablets and also kind of uh, industrial level ta uh, tablets, like you get waterproof or even bulletproof. So for military even? No, Maybe. no, we don't have the plan. We are still focusing on this com uh, consumer electronics market. And maybe for, uh, for education, uh, yeah. schools, uh, yeah, for school. kids, but uh, there's, I think hopefully opportunity for new markets like I really like the All Winner 64 uh, uh, laptop. Maybe there will be more laptops, some two in ones, stuff like that will also be possible, right? Yes, indeed. We yeah. also have the plans to. Now, currently, our A63 is capable for building the the tablets products. So mostly target focused, but uh, I guess as you're showing the AI support over there, maybe it could be in a car product too. And this is even relevant here, the artificial intelligence. I think it's one of the ADAS system, which is aiding your aiding the driver when they're driving a the car. They can mark it whether you are going the strict trajectory on the road. And he detected and reflected on the screen in front of your the mirror real uh, yeah, the so mirror, you can have the, the smart mirror, mirror, mirror yeah. with a new chipset. Yes. And, and it can recognize the, the babies. Entertainment system. So you can have like little little play robots in the room that can recognize people and see if everybody's okay. Yes. Let's just jump in there again because it could be interesting. Maybe there's something else What's they're talking about. So, so who are all these people at the press conference? Is it only few media, right? No, the that that colleague is talking is the project manager of our A10 and A20, the most uh, successful chipset or we not have in before. Yeah. So, but um, the people in the room are customers? Yeah, our customers and, and these people from the independent design houses and our customer like branding and also some different marketing, not only tablets, but most of them are, are, are from the tablet industries. It was interesting, the first 40 minutes of the show, yeah. it was uh, interviews with your customers where they I don't, I don't know how to say, maybe have requirements or maybe not complain, but they're like, it's a big challenge. The tablet market is, is, uh, is you know, uh, is not as good as when A10, A13, four or five years ago. Yes. It's, it's being a little bit more challenging. And uh, why are we here? Because it's talking about technology design. We're in a design, uh, design center here in Shenzhen, right? Yes. Design museum or design... 
place. All right, so, uh, so this is going to be uh, much more in the future with All Winner. This is just one event, yeah. and you will have uh, the, the China Sourcing Fair starting in a couple days. Yes, we have the exhibition in the Hong Kong Global Source exhibitions. We are setting up the exclusive meeting rooms. So then customers rooms. can meet you there too? Yes, as well. Cool. And uh, looking forward to maybe what will happen later this year or next year, there will be some new chips too. Yes. Some new, maybe some higher specs, some, some lower, some different. Yeah.